the African mind must change. We need more people like this young man here. Because what is happening in Africa today is unacceptable. We can take care of ourselves. We have the largest arable land on the continent, and yet in some countries we are importing food. Why should Africa unite? I believe it is. it can't be done, it is not going to be easy, and in fact I dare say that the people who are going to stand in the way of African unity are active professional politicians. Because a politician who is a cabinet minister in a country A fears that when we have a bigger Africa, then there will be a small fish in a small pond and they will not survive. Those who are simply looking for positions will find that a bigger Africa is not a very comfortable, comfortable thing. And I have no doubt in my mind that going forward, our strength will lie in our unity. It is not going to be easy. It may not happen in our lifetime, but if indeed it does, it's something that we ought to do. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, from wherever you are watching from across the globe. Welcome to Africa Trends TV. Africans on the continent and the diaspora have made a determination to sign the petition for Dr. Arikana Chimborokwao and Professor Piero Lumumba as next AU Commission Chair and Deputy. Let me go ahead and read exactly what it says. African heads of state and government, there is a time and a season for everything under the sun. A time to be born and a time to die. A time for war and a time for peace. This is a time for something new in the African continent. We would tear and mend the African Union. After decades of agony, travail and manipulation, Africans at home and abroad have decided to put an end to this suffering, servitude and deprivation we exhort our presidents to listen and act as this could be the most serious demand africans have ever made to its leadership we put our ears to the ground to congratulate all the leaders who will yield to this request we the children of africa humbly wish and request dr arikana chimboro kwao and patrick lock Otieno Lumumba, popularly known as PLO Lumumba, should be the next chair and deputy chair of the African Union Commission. Also, that the above two great leaders should be surrounded and advised by tough Africans like His Excellency Jerry John Rawlings, Mo Ibrahim the Sudanese Bilonia, Julius Selo Malema, Professor Nicholas. Agboho, Dr. Samuel Mati, the father of Zero, Kemi Siba, born as Teleogilis Roberts, and our Nigerian daughter, Adiola Oyedele Fayehu, who will be a future treasurer to Africa. Africa has thousands of outstanding intellectuals who are adding their contributions to the advancement of this prejudiced continent but we don't have space to name them all we should note that those who propose to advise and work closely with dr arikana and plo lumumba were not contacted it's just a random list of some extraordinary africans who track records and are unparalleled and can be easily verified. We are not ignorant of the undue influence and pressure exerted on the African leaders and people by the former colonial masters. We are also aware that the people of East Asia, through their debt contracts, have also trapped our continent and exposed us to several additional servitudes. Although some of you are incompetent and corrupt, 
we don't doubt that some of you are great leaders but rendered helpless by foreign influence our request to hand over power of au commission to these two proposed iconic figures was arrived at after carefully considering the vulnerability of all sitting african heads of state each time they commit to rescue and enhance the prosperity of their countries or the continent consequently we the people of africa have decided to demolish the status quo although the african continent remains the richest in natural resources arable land and youthful population she is still considered the wrecked on the earth this submission should mark the beginning of better days to come people of africa reflect sign this petition and rejoice for things will never be the same again the time for collective action is now our son moka faki has tried his best but he can't offer more than he has africa is giving this lofty responsibility to dr arikana chimboru kwao and pielo lumumba because of their high calling and purpose again don't hesitate to sign this petition share it in all platforms to get all sons and daughters of our motherland have their imprint on this historic revolution that is going to change the destiny of the african continent signed the people of africa below are some of the reasons why people are signing this petition felapi martin says prof lumumba must be elected as chief Nkrumah sheku says i believe in these two people they will redirect africa to a better continent Senator A says a new Africa with new leadership and agenda. Constance Ibong says they are among the best in the moment with the vision that with the vision that will advance our continent. Kudos to the team. By Silly Injinga says I want a change in our continent. I want a change in our continental leadership. One that will make the lives of the people better joyce alugo says unfortunately unfortunately to have to petition these two individuals meritoriously more than qualifies for the position anthony michael says these are our voices in africa sanzan diara also says we need a corruption free africa a men and women of integrity in charge of the continent to de- to develop lamin sanyang says they can move africa into unity we call united states of africa where we can have one currency one federal reserve bank and protect our natural resources from exploitation Elizabeth Bass also said those two are true pan africanists Amore Kiruri also says it should be for the great interest of Africa and I believe given the blessing by us the people they will fight for the interest of all Africans to protect our right and dignity and as Ambe we these two for change to come to Africa Philomena Ekhato says I believe in the credible leadership they will provide I like the fact that they think African George Tete I strongly believe Africa now needs change and needs to work together the list goes on and on and on because the people of Africa along the globe support this petition I want the AU has to know that they have recognized Dr. Arikana Chimborukwa, Pielo Lumumba and the others that they can be part of the goal of changing the Africa we want. We need all Africans 
to be part of this agenda. When we decide to be unconcerned, then it will be very difficult for us to meet the agenda we as the Africans need. The little you could also do is to let this petition go as far as it can by signing and sharing this petition. Remember that until we get involved in the change we want for Africa, we will still be where we are. Thank you very much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell, like and comment. If there is anything you want me to do, if there is something you don't like about the video, kindly put it in the comment section and I will respond to that. Thank you and we stay in touch again.